Hey everyone, it's Miss Alana here working on math, getting smarter and smarter every day, just like you. Today is Tuesday, September 26, 2017, and we are working on today's math assignment. What assignment is that? Is it next level ultimate extreme expressions? Or I think I changed it. It was just like next level extreme expressions. Excuse if this screen is shaking. I am using the iPad right now. The laptop was like going dead and I'm like, ah! can't use that or else it'll cut it off so I'm using the laptop and I'm like holding it with one hand here and like trying to do it like this all right so today since it is next level expressions raise your hand if you are finished with Monday if not go back and get that done I recorded 10 episodes yesterday of what was that of Monday's math assignment of next level extreme expressions so if you need to make corrections on that go back and check that video if you need to complete it go back and check that video for some help with that all right since this is next level I am not going to do the same thing today I am going to do something a little bit different I am going to show you my work all right so you should have this right there there's Tuesday Make sure you have this glued in your notebook. Go ahead and cut out the Tuesday part. Look, I, I have to like use one hand here. So go ahead and cut Tuesday, bam. You see it, it's right there, it's like sideways, ah, right there. All right, so I am going to show you not everything in this one episode, I am going to show you my expressions and you need to figure out the work for it. All right, so for example, these, can you see? Can you, can you see it if I do it like that? All right, so there's the expression, there's the work. All right, expressions work. All right, but I'm not going to show you everything. Let me see. I got to do it like this. I don't know if you can see that. Maybe I just need to do it like this. All right, let me get that paper out the way. And let's just do it like this. All right, so for number one, your answer should be 506. Not going to show you the work. All right, so you need to figure out how to multiply 64 times 7. You need to do on the other side, like bloop, right there, how I got 448, okay? And then you need to show how you added that to 58, bloop, right there, to get 506. All right? Now, for number two, the answer is 1,000, what is that? 1,023. So first, I multiplied 341 times 9, and I got 3,069, bloop, right there, all right? And then divided by 3, show the work. Bloop, right there, show the work, and you should show me how you got that. All right, so you need to prove to me how you got that answer because some of you are just copying my answers and then not learning how to do it. So make sure I want to know if you know how to do that or not. All right, and number three, right there, the answer is 216. So you need to show how you um, show your work, show your work, show how you, you did the exponent, show how you subtracted, show how you multiplied, bloop, right there. All right, moving on to number four. The answer for number four, there's my expression and the work for it is 530. So on, on that side, you need to show how you did your exponents, how you subtracted, how you multiplied, and how you divided. All right, ah, struggling over here. All right, number five, the answer is 57,784. 57,784. So show your work right there. How you added to get 932 and then show how you multiplied. Bam, right there. Either the standard algorithm or the area model. All right, and moving on to number, what number is that? That's number six. My answer is 13,958. So on your work side, on your work side, I want you to show how you subtracted, how you did your exponent, how you multiplied, and how you subtracted at the end. All right, so we are done with number six. Moving on to number seven. Number seven, I have to turn the page. All right, so number seven is right there. And my answer for number seven is 7,200. If you see... Ooh, you can like kind of take a peek at my work. Take a peek. Take a peek, but don't copy it. Ah, ah. All right, so make sure that you show how you got the answer. And for number eight, uh, the answer for that one is 684,000. Ah. All right, see right there, 684,000. So remember, you're doing the expression on that side. Show your work. 
show you. Or maybe I'll kind of let you peek at that real quick. Uh, uh, uh. Oh, no. All right. And then number nine, there's number nine. My answer for that is 76. And make sure you show your work. Show your work. All right. And then the last one, number 10, is 44,766. So there's my expression with the work and the work for that. All right. Now, like I said, I am not going to show you my work because I need to know if you know how to do the multiplying, the dividing. Um, and then if not, see if you have somebody at home that can help you. Or actually, if you can put it in the comments below, maybe like I need some help and maybe someone can help you or I can probably respond to you in the comments below. Uh, let me see. Hmm. Make sure you have everything done because tomorrow we are probably going to do a Miss Alana's math game show. Oh, welcome to the game show. Give me some game show music where you can win absolutely nothing. Yes, or some dojo points. That's right. You get to earn some dojo points tomorrow at our game show. Have your VIP card. I might let some of you all go ahead and redeem that to be the VIP of the classroom tomorrow. So make sure you have that. Um, let me see what else. Oh, and it's STEM day. So we'll do other activities. Also, make sure you have your notebook with you. Make sure your parents check class dojo. Make sure you get everything done. I will check that tomorrow until I see you tomorrow. I love you all. Keep working hard. Do your best. Keep practicing and help out at home. All right. Love you. Mwah.